today, we are releasing a program that you can buy a home with literally zero down payments. Basically, you're going to get 3% of the price. So if the price is 300000 you might need $1,500 for the rest of the down payment. Rudy and his gang are wonderful at creating closing cost credits, so you can literally get in the house cheaper than you can if you went and rented one. Buying a home, mm -hmm. 500000 <laughs> it's single family home. Right. What was the limit on this? What's the qualification? Well, the limit is is 45% of their income. So with with their income and stuff, so they can go higher if they have really no bills. Hmm. That's but, the best way, but it depends on their income where we can go to. But we included the husband and wife or just one and, and the other? Or? It depends, like if husband and wife are other, under the income limits, like let's say in LA County they're doing FHA and the husband and wife make 82,000, we can use it. Okay. If the husband makes 68,000, he's got a son working McDonald's for two years, made 14, we can use him and the dad and leave the wife off or leave the husband off, whoever, yeah. whoever we So this is them. a grant money, meaning it's a gift. It's not a lien on a property. The only right. requirement is, is that they stay in the loan house for at least eight months and make payments. You have to live, you live, you live in a house for eight months. Your income cannot be more than 100, uh, 84,295. That's the max. Mm -hmm. If it's uh, and then you you gotta live in it for eight months and FICO and, score six hundred forty. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you right. basically get the down payment for free. So even if you have the down payment, there's no reason not to utilize this <clears throat> and get free money. If your um, FICO is a little bit lower than six forty, what can you do to help? We will look at. We will run the credit, and most lenders won't give it out. I will email the credit to the client, and I say. I want you to print it and we're going to go over line for line what to do with each account. If they have medical collections, we're going to get them deleted. If they have regular collections, I say leave them alone, we'll pay them at the end. Because if you have a collection for Verizon mm -hmm. and you pay it today, the report date becomes new and it lowers your FICO, even though you paid it, as crazy as it sounds. we might. I told somebody the other day, go get two secure credit cards, call Capital One. Why? Because you get a secure credit card, within a month or two, it's going to build your FICO up, but just don't use it. If it's $300 limit credit card, stay under 25%. That helps your FICO score. Um, I had one lady that was at a 580. She borrowed 25 grand against her 401k. We paid off four medical collections. We paid off three credit cards that were like 14 grand. Her score went up to 668. Yeah. And this is not limited only to first time home buyers. No, you can be selling a property and moving into this. Because you don't know, technically, if you sell a property on a Monday, you don't close your purchase till Tuesday, you don't own because you've closed it. That's right. If you have any other questions, comment below or call 626-789-0159 again for a free private one-on-one -on -one consultation so you can move out of that Dingy little apartment and start their journey of home ownership with zero down. Can you believe it? I can't believe it. This is amazing. Right? Most people say, dude, see, most real estate agents, they, they make people feel like they're a loser. Yes. You know, right? like, <laughs> Not us. Say, or whoever told you you're such a loser, you don't qualify, you don't have the money, the FICO is too low, whatever, doesn't really matter. Come here, we'll, we'll get you into your new home. Anything else, Helen? No. That's it. Make it a great day.